Welcome to the Norwegian Sun. I'm back in Seattle. I'm going to do a ship tour. We're going to take this tour deck by deck. You're going to love it. Let's go ahead and get started. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to start off here on the upper decks. I'm here at the main pool area. We are exactly midship. It's one of my favorite spots and a favorite among cruisers. It's the pool area. Here you're going to enjoy a couple of pools and some whirlpools. Throughout the entire cruise, there is always going to be entertainment here. There will be live bands, DJs, and activities. The cool thing is that sometimes in the evening, there will even be dance parties here. So it's a really good reason to take a look at the app while you're on board so you don't miss anything. The main pools here are pretty long and a really decent size for a smaller ship. The Norwegian Sun is on the smaller side of cruise ships, but as we go through it, you'll notice that it is action packed and has many venues. The Norwegian Sky is just like the Norwegian Sun. I also had that on my channel as well. Right here is the basketball court. It is a full court and they offer other activities here as well, such as soccer, dodgeball, and other fun games. And you'll also see these activities on your app. So when you get on board, if you don't have it downloaded yet, make sure you download it right away because you're gonna use that every single day. You'll notice that the basketball court is directly above the pool area. Right around the corner from the basketball court are the ping pong tables. Keep your eye out if you're competitive because you can get into a tournament. Now down here in the main pool area, there are two pools, four whirlpools, plenty of places to sit, relax, and enjoy the sun, plenty of places to hang out and listen to the live music or the DJs. Also over here at the end of the pool is a bar. Come on over, grab a mixed drink or a nice cold beer at Top Ciders. They have stools where you can sit back and relax and just enjoy the day. Now right through here is the sports bar and grill. And this is also another favorite among cruisers. It is complimentary, so it is included in your cruise fare and it is always open late. You can enjoy delicious delights like wings, fish and chips, hamburgers, nachos, salads, soups. It's a really cool spot to stop in after a good night of drinking. You'll be able to enjoy sports and other events here as well. There are plenty of TVs and they always have the games on. Let's head on into the arcade. When you come into the arcade to play these games, you do not need any coins. You will use your key card. So folks, if you do not want your kids to have access to your bank card, you can turn their key card off. Let's head on into Moderno Churrascaria. This is the Brazilian Steakhouse. At nighttime, you can come in for dinner and they're gonna cut skewers of meat right onto your plate. During the day, it's a buffet. So there's a salad bar and a pizza station. Let's go ahead and head into the Garden Cafe. This is right here in the pool area. This is the buffet area. It's open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And it is completely complimentary which means it's included in your cruise fare. Folks, keep in mind, as I was saying before, that the sun is just like the Norwegian sky. They're smaller ships, but they're action packed. And if you wanna book either one, make sure you give me a call. You'll be so glad you did. Especially on the sky and the sun, we have access to exclusive rates. Well, that's right. So in addition to getting you all the promotions that Norwegian offers, we're going to give you an exclusive agency discount. It is wonderful and Norwegian allows us to do it. So here's what you're going to want to do. You're going to want to call that 1-800 number right there on your screen. These are unpublished rates, so they're not on our website. So get the best rate guaranteed and that amazing discount. Call that 1-800 number right now. The cool thing about the buffet area is that it extends all the way here to the back of the ship. This is the outside seating area and outside buffet area. So here's a little tip. If it's really busy inside, come on outside because a lot of times people aren't out here and you can grab something to eat really quickly. And is what's really cool is that there are amazing views off the back of the ship and there's a bar right here where you can grab a drink. Let's head on up a deck and take a look at one of my favorite specialty dining restaurants. This is 
Le Bistro. This is the French restaurant. The way the specialty dining works is, is that there is an additional charge, but check this out. There are plenty of complimentary options on board. So Le Bistro being a specialty restaurant just gives you the option. Let's go ahead and take a look at a few more specialty dining venues. This is where you're gonna find Los Lobos, Teponyaki, and Cagney Steakhouse. This right here is Teponyaki. This is where the Japanese chefs are gonna cook the meals right in front of you. If you're with a small party, they may put you with another party, but it's a lot of fun because it's a cool social event. Right here is Cagney's Steakhouse. Right before you walk into Cagney's, there's a nice bar where you can grab a drink. In Cagney Steakhouse, you can order prime cuts of meat. Because what they're gonna do is it's part of the specialty dining and you do get four courses. Let's head on up a deck. We're gonna go a deck above the pool deck and take a look at Champ's Bar. This is also the smoking section. And is what I really like about this area is that it's far away from all of the other venues. So if you're a smoker, you can relax, have your cigarette, and you're not gonna bother anybody. And if you're not a smoker, hey, there's not gonna be any smoke that's gonna bother you, so it's perfect. Right around the corner is the children's pool and world pool. Let's head on in to Spinnaker Lounge. This is all the way at the front of the ship. It is a fun area to hang out in. Throughout the entire cruise, they're gonna offer activities, dancing, and live music. There's a bar right over here, which is a perfect spot to sit down and grab a drink. They have comfortable stools and comfortable chairs throughout the entire area. And as what's really cool about it is that they have panoramic views all throughout the front of the ship. Let's head on down to the lower decks. We're gonna go to deck seven. We're gonna start off right here at the champagne bar. If you want a premium bottle of champagne, stop on by. Now, if you have a drink package, remember the bottles are not included. You're gonna have to get it by the glass. This is the atrium. All three decks converge right here. Let's head on into the gambling area. This is the Sun Casino. It is a full casino. You can find Texas Hold'em, Blackjack, plenty of slots, all kinds of card tables. They offer tournaments. You can play craps. You can also play roulette. Here's the cool thing. Keep an eye on that app because they have really good tournaments. Over here is the Stardust Theater. Here you can enjoy musicals, magic shows. Sometimes late at night, the comedians will perform in here. And if you booked an excursion with the cruise line, most likely you're gonna meet up here early in the morning. This is the photo gallery. This is where you're gonna find the photos that the photographers took of you while you were on board the ship. All you have to do is swipe your card and all the photos will come up. Let's head on into the library. It's right here by the photo gallery. A lot of guests like to come in here and read a book or just relax. Right here is the Windjammer Bar. This is a favorite among cruisers to come in and have a before or after dinner drink. It's nice to relax and listen to the piano player. Right around the corner is the Havana Club. So if you wanna grab a stogie, head on over here. This is the Bliss Ultra Lounge. This is where a lot of action takes place. Throughout the cruise, there will be dance parties, activities. Sometimes they'll offer karaoke. On sea days, you can come in and find many different things taking place here. Come over and have a nice seat at the bar and just relax. Let's head on back to the atrium. Remember, decks five, six, and seven all converge right here. We're gonna go to deck five. Here you're gonna find guest services, the shore excursions desk, and if you need to inquire about onboard credit, head on over here. Across the way is the Atrium Cafe. You can order a specialty Starbucks coffee here or get yourself a nice treat. You can also come over here and inquire about internet services if you have any trouble locking on. This is the Four Seasons restaurant. This is a complimentary dining venue. The way Norwegian works is that they are freestyle, so you do not have to make a reservation. Let's head on in to La Cucina. This is the Italian restaurant. It's part of the specialty dining. If you want to see the difference between specialty and complimentary and the pricing, check out the link I placed down below the description of the video under dining. This is Seven Seas. This is also part of the complimentary dining. It is freestyle dining, so you do not have to make any reservations. All you have to do is come on in while it's open. And they're open for 
breakfast, lunch, and dinner. This is the Mandara Spa and Salon. They have many different massages and meta spa services. It's a good idea to come in and take a tour. If you need to get your hair done or your nails done, ladies, there is a salon right over here. The cool thing is what I really like about the spa here is that in the locker rooms, they have a sauna and a steam room. So make sure you're aware of that. Don't miss it. Let's head on into the gym. Right here is the aerobics room. So they offer many different classes. So make sure you check that out. And here is the gym where you'll find Stairmasters, free weights, plenty of machines. It's open pretty much the entire cruise. They'll close it late at night. So just be aware of that. If you like to work out in the morning, just ask them to open it a little early and maybe they'll accommodate. Thank you for joining me on the tour. This is Jason. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to get the best rate guaranteed. Give me a call. My number's right there on the screen.